Good morning. It is uh, bright and early. Ready to send these two, I don't even know where they are, these two to school. I barely got dressed and we have to hit the road and there's a few things that I have to run and get today. One being a present for one of Ezra's little friends. Um, they have 50% off sale and it ends today so I have to go do that after I drop them off at school. And then, yeah, it's gonna be a busy day. I technically don't work today, but I work. So you guys know what I'm talking about. So it's gonna be busy. These two get to go to school. Are you guys excited to be back to school? Yeah. Yeah. Show everybody what happened to your eye. Uh, here? Yeah. What happened? Uh, it got bruised. How did it get bruised? We don't actually entirely know. You were wrestling, weren't you? So this one, um, he was downstairs with Asen and a friend, and they came up, and I looked at him and I was like, what's wrong with your eye? And he didn't even realize that he had done anything to his eye. So I guess he must have heard it wrestling and he didn't even notice. But it looks pretty nasty, but he says it doesn't hurt, so I guess boys will be boys. Asen, are you excited to go to Vancouver? Yes and no? Yes and no. Ezra, are you excited to go to Vancouver? No! Yes! yes. RDS? What's the RDS? Where? Where do you see that? No signal! That? I have no idea what that means. It's a daddy question. Wait, RDS? Yeah, right there. That's an impossible infinity Ooh, you smell good. Smell like what's in here? Smell like blueberries. What's in there? Yeah. I love you. Straight to your room, okay? Let's see where another one comes out, okay? Because that's another one comes out in there. Okay. Bye. Watch for cars and go straight to your doors. Love you, Ezra. Bye. Put your hat on. Put your hat on. Literally too many options. The little girl said she just liked rainbow loom, so too many options. All right, so I found one. I picked this one. It was the last one. Apparently, you can like put names and stuff in it, so hopefully, it's the right one. It was the last one of this kind, so I figured it was pretty popular. So I have successfully dropped the boys off at school. I have filled up my tank with gas and I got a great deal because gas went up to like a buck. I think it was a buck 23 by my house and Costco had it for a buck nine, so score. And then I got the rainbow loom for the birthday party on the weekend. So I should be going home because I have some work to do. I'm just not quite ready to go and face it yet. So I'm gonna run into Goodwill. I'm gonna run into the thrift store. I've been looking for a few pieces to kind of update my living room and I'm probably not gonna find anything at this Goodwill because it's not a very good one. But I thought I might as well because I'm out and I have no kids. And again, I just don't want to go home. I'm not ready to face that. So yeah, it's been a successful morning and it's only what, like 9.30? Granted, I haven't gotten a shower yet. So there's that. <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, so I'm back. Back to housework. Um, first shower, <laughs> get that done. So as suspected, I didn't really find much there um, as far as like decorations or um, some pieces for my living room, but I did find some Converse. So they're $15, which I thought was kind of a little bit much for you shoes, but they're already like, they're starting to fade a little bit here. So my idea is to see if I can actually get these things to bleach. If I can get these things to bleach, that'd be stinking awesome. And then I got this, this was brand new. It was $3.50, but it is a, I don't know where the name is on it. There it is, a Contigo. And it's brand new, it actually still has, if I can get it open. 
it still had the instructions in it. So, um, yeah, Ezra needed a new new cup for school because he fills this with water. I don't send juice boxes. I just send water to school with them. So, um, yeah, that was kind of a good little find. So, it's already after 10 and I've got some housework to accomplish and who knows what else is going to pop up today. So, I'm going to go and get that done and maybe eat groceries. I have to get groceries today. That's what I need to do, but I might just do that later. So, the puppy just needs love. Hmm. Do you just need love? Because you never get enough lovings. I picked up my camera again so whoa super white um, I have had my shoes that I bought the other day sitting in a sink full of half water half bleach and I'm gonna show you guys what they look like it's been just a little over 24 hours at about I want to say five hours I came down and the shoes were turning orange and I panicked and I thought I just ruined these shoes I'm screwed I'm gonna have to garbage them so instead of panicking I left them in the sink and said you know what I'm just gonna leave them again wake up in the morning and see what happens. So, this morning when I came down, it had, it had improved and I'm gonna show you guys what they look like now. Make sure I get this on before I drop it in the bleach. So this is the shoes now. They're still kind of orange. I don't know why those are still black, um, but they have made progress. I really truly think that the person who had it before tried to cover up some of these spots with a sharpie or something um, because it looks like when they were faded they just drew on them. So yeah, that's kind of what they look like. They've been sitting for a long time. See this right here? I think that's sharpie. And I don't know if that's going to be able to come out. So it has been 24 hours. Now, I think I might throw them in a washing machine and wash them and rinse them and then throw them in bleach again because they're still not quite white. They're kind of pink, which is kind of fun. I mean, I, I don't, I've never had, I've never had pink Converse, so maybe pink will be kind of fun and I'm thinking if they're not fully pink, I might like see if I can find some, I don't know, fabric dye at Walmart and dye them pink because that might be fun. So yeah, that's what they've turned out like so far. I'm gonna wash them up here and I'm gonna see if that makes a difference and then I'm gonna try to bleach them one more time um, and leave them for another 24 hours and see if they can go any whiter. And if not, backup plan is to dye them pink, I guess. They are pink with a nice big black mark. And I'm gonna try it one more time. See if I can get that out. So, round two of bleach and water. Before I ended the vlog, I wanted to show you guys what the shoes turned out like. Um, they didn't really change very much from the last time that I put them in the bleach and water round two. So I'm gonna have to get some pink dye and dye them, but I think they're actually pretty cool. So I'm gonna show you guys what it turned out like. So they're pretty much the same color. I don't know, it kind of looks tan on the camera, but they're more of like a really, really, really light peach color. So they're still sitting in the bleach. This came out a little bit more, although it doesn't really look like it. The camera is so deceiving, guys. Um, yes, this is broken. I need to fix it. It's on my list of many, many things to do. It looks like some of the black came out, though. 
So I'm gonna let these dry and I'll probably wash them again one more time and then um, I think I'm gonna take them with me when we go to Vancouver. I have an obsession with, with Converse so I'll just wear them as is. I think they're still cute. And then I'll probably dye them later. But yeah, that's how they turned out. The white got super white by bleaching them, so that's kind of cool. So yeah, that was kind of a fun little experiment to try out. I don't know that I would do it again just because it was a lot of work and they didn't quite turn out the way I wanted them to. But seeing as I already had a pair of black ones, um, it's kind of cool that I have another color. So yeah. Um, let me know in the comments below, have you guys ever tried to dye something, whether that was like shoes or clothes or, or blankets or, I don't know, whatever. It's kind of neat to see the process, so let me know in the comments below if you guys have ever tried it, because, yeah, it's kind of fun. Anyways, guys, uh, if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.